Which one do I choose, bro? Bill, I'm in the mood for a switch up. I hit the function, hit the rose till I hiccup. I hit the stage and leave with me. What's happening, guys? What the business is? It's your boy Bobby P, man. Checking in with another video of Bobby's World. I'm about to give you part two of my sequel. So you want to smoke cigars, huh? And in this video, I'm going to teach you about the most common types of cigar leaves and cigar wrappers that cigars have to offer. It's a lot, but I'm only going to give you seven of the most common type of cigar leaves. And if you're a beginner, I can teach you how to identify which one is the best cigar wrapper for you to try first. And my suggestion. Now, this leaf that I'm about to get into first is actually a most common leaf um, in certain brands such as Rocky Patel, uh, Romeo and Julieta, um, certain brands like that. A candela leaf is actually a medium bodied leaf, which means that it's typically strong. Some beginners can smoke this too. However, this is usually for those cigar smokers who's been smoking for a while and can identify the different notes within this wrapper. Leaf. And candela leaf is a doodle green color. That's right, I said doodle green color. And this leaf is very green because of the abundance of chlorophyll, which resulted from it being picked young versus it being mature and being picked then. However, it was picked young with curation, and that's why it has an abundance of chlorophyll, which gives off its green color. Now, number two on my list is the Connecticut leaf. Now, I smoked this when I was a beginner. A Connecticut leaf is a light-bodied cigar. It actually has a lighter leaf, and a lot of these brands that have these lighter leaves, honestly, you can find them in any brand, um, Camacho, uh, Perdomo, Racky Patel, um, Gurkha, any, any cigar brand of your choice. The Connecticut leaf is amazing for beginners. This actually is my suggestion for beginners. The Connecticut leaf is a light body cigar. This cigar was actually grown in Connecticut, hence its name, Connecticut Wrapper. <laughs> However, um, it is now grown in Ecuador. This cigar is actually grown in the shade and not directly in the sunlight because directly in the sunlight is going to not be a kinetic leaf. It's going to be a darker leaf and it's going to be a stronger note versus the hint is it's a lighter leaf with light notes, which is perfect for beginners. How cigars are made with a Connecticut leaf is very like soft. Um, this is a very thin leaf. And if you press too hard or if you do too much like you do with the other kind of leaves, uh, this leaf is going to tear very easily. But overall, my suggestion, Connecticut leaves are actually one of my favorite leaves to smoke. It is light, light to medium body, but mainly light. And this cigar is excellent, excellent. And when I say excellent, excellent for a beginner's palate. Number three on the list is the Rosado wrapper. I don't know if you go into a cigar shop and you see a reddish wrapper. This is called a risotto wrapper. It is a medium body wrapper and with the taste, it has an earthy taste and it is easy to roll, which means that it's easy to create a cigar with this one because it's nice and thick and just, it will not tear easily like the Connecticut leaf. And in this brand, you can find different brands such as Romeo and Julieta, um, just more of the Davidoff, more of the more expensive brands usually use the risotto leaf. All right, number four on my list is the Sumatra leaf. A Sumatra wrapper is actually a light to medium body, which means that it's not as strong, but it can get strong in, 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 in certain hint notes of the cigar. However, it's not usually as strong, so beginners can also smoke this as well, too. But with taste, it has a floral taste uh, throughout the cigar, but also has a creamy consistency, pause, which makes it a smooth and irresistible taste because of the floral hit notes and of the creamy consistency within the floral hit notes that makes it an even burn and just an overall better taste on your palate. And the color of this is usually dull brown and you can find this, like again, by Leaf by Oscars or different other brands, but most, most typically by Leaf by Oscar cigar. Number five on the list is the natural wrapper. This natural wrapper is found in all brands of cigars. So your favorite brand cigar, even if you're a beginner, um, you pick a cigar up, it's going to be in that brand regardless. With the regular wrapper, it is light to medium body. So again, beginners can smoke this with no problem without being too strong for them or too strong for their palate. The flavor in the regular cigar wrapper is usually a coffee flavor and it's excellent with, you can pair it with any coffee of your choice, a cappuccino, espresso, whatever it is, iced coffee, even a whiskey or a bourbon, even maybe a red wine. Usually it is typically found in punch cigars, but you can also find it in, again, any other cigar of your choice. However, um, punch cigars usually make this one of their trademark wrappers for their cigar line. We get in there guys, number six on the list 
is the Cameroon rapper. And no, this is not originated in Cameroon, Africa. This rapper is actually a toothy leaf. So it is actually shaped as a tooth, honestly. You could pack so many flavors in this cigar. And this cigar is usually, again, light to medium body. The brand that is usually made in a toothy cigar is Fuente Cigars, which are excellent, by the way. And we're here, guys. Number seven is the Corojo Wrapper. This is a full to medium body wrapper, which means that it's kind of strong. Um, I, I would suggest this for, you know, more advanced cigar smokers, not necessarily for beginners, unless you just want to go full force in into the heavy ones. Um, the flavor in this is cocoa and actually it has hints of spices in it so it is kind of spicy however uh you'll taste more cocoa than a spicy in this brand you will find more of the camacho brands that uses the corojo wrapper right, there you guys have the seven most common types of cigar leaf that you will find in a cigar shop or the cigar lounge especially my take for beginners but beginners listen it's your choice if you want to start off strong start off strong you want to start off light start off light but i gave you my suggestions guys and i just want to say thank you guys again for tuning into another episode of bobby's world i'm not going to wait so long to post the third part the last part of it um but i just want to say thank you guys again love y'all see you in the next video peace hey 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 man i'm just doing